Alright, join me with EIU football coach Adam Cushing and coach two thirds of the way through spring practice and I guess evaluate where you guys were on day one as to where you are now after day ten. Uh, well, obviously we, we, had, we had a lot to learn on day one. Um, but uh, I think today was, was was a big step forward. I think today was was a great Tuesday morning, and um, you know after uh, after a weekend where we got we, we had a really good go on Saturday. It was great to see the guys come back with a ton of energy, a ton of want to get better today. And there's a lot of little things that we can keep on improving. But we had a great attitude this morning. Now, just like you would see in a regular football game, momentum can shift back and forth, and the same thing kind of happens in practice. Saturday ended up looked like it was offensive day. Today looked like it was defense. I'm sure that you're happy that both sides are kind of responding to the challenge. Yeah, no one wins spring practice, and, and that's part of the nature of, uh, of, of spring practice, fall camp, that, uh, that one side of the ball is going to be happy, the other side's not going to be so happy. But, uh, but yeah, it's great to see the, the defense come out and respond, but, uh, but I really think that they're, they're both – Showed some great things uh, both days, but there's uh, you know there's always going to be an ebb and flow, and, and, and we got to do a great job of, of talking about momentum and and how to you know keep it on our sideline when we have it, and how to grab it back when the, when it's changed addresses. Now you got a, a third of the spring practice left. Kind of what's the, the message to the team? What do you want to see out of them to kind of get that spring into into the offseason workouts? I think we, we want to keep on um, the idea of just getting be one day better every day. Just just keep on improving, um, working to trust ourselves a little bit more every day on the football field. And uh, the more familiar we are with the lingo, the more times, the more reps we get at it. I think uh, all the guys are getting more comfortable with it. Um, but being being able to stretch themselves a little bit more, stretch their daily best, and uh, and, and then we're, we're you know we're putting a lot more situations into practice. So starting to be able to get their mind turned over into those situations, so that uh, when we get to it in the fall, that it's not foreign and, and all the calls sound right. But but there's a mentality about the situations as well. Now you were able to have a number of you guys, the guys that you guys had signed in your, your first recruiting class here this, this weekend. I, I'm assuming you have more of those guys that will come in over the next couple of weeks. Yeah, I think uh, you know we're, they just want to come back and, uh, and and be in their new home again here for you know what's going to be their home for the next four or five years. But also um, you know just get a chance to to get a good picture of what what their process is going to be about. So um, every opportunity they get to see it, it's going to make them more prepared for for this fall. Appreciate your time, coach. Absolutely, go Panthers.